What's going on, everyone? I uh, hope everyone's doing well. I wanted to uh, take a couple moments to uh, talk about taking time to reflect on your journey. And this is something I've been thinking about uh, for a little bit uh, after a couple uh, recent wins of mine uh, with tennis. And I think it's important to look back on how far you've come from a, a certain position where you weren't doing as well as you wanted, and then you overcame that and moved forward. Uh, no matter how humble uh, the task may be, and I, for me, it's been it's been pretty crazy to think about how far I've come in tennis, uh, starting from a very very low level, then getting up higher in the ranks. Uh, that was a personal goal I set for myself, and it's part of my journey, and that journey is important to me. And for whatever you're working towards, uh, that part of you that is important to put time and effort and energy into, uh, so that you can figure out who you really are. And I think that's part of, of why we take on difficult challenges uh, in life, uh, because you don't want everything to be on easy mode. If you just walk up uh, to any situation and you don't get pushed, you don't get challenged, you're really not going to de develop a, a true character or, or how uh, you really know how you're going to overcome difficult situations, because life is just difficult. <laughs> I mean, it, some people say it's easy, and it's like they're, they're lying to you. Uh, so... Uh, I, it, as a coach and as a player, um, I always uh, focus on that person's journey. And part of that journey is what do you do when you con are confronted by adversity? And I, I've seen all different levels of, of uh, response to adversity. Some people get really frustrated and upset. Other people more quiet and reserved. And it's very, very few people have the determination to, to move through that no matter how unenjoyable the process is, uh, they, they find their goal and they move towards it. And I find that, especially on the tennis court, uh, the players who have that, uh, that kind of that natural tenacity or, or determination, typically that reflects in their personality as well. They have great character. They seem to be more concerned about how to help people and are less selfish, uh, in, in my uh, opinion, uh, from, from th some of the things I've seen. Uh, but that's part of your journey and part of your story. And uh, as I take time to reflect on how far I've come uh, on my path and trying to get to UST 4.5, which I'm getting pretty close now, I'm developing the skills I need. Um, it's it's amazing to think about, you know, where I was before and then where I am now. And it was just it was a lot of effort and a lot of dedication and frustration. But I put in the time and energy and the the sense of satisfaction I get from that. Um, regardless of the comparison to others, for me and, and my process, uh, I'm very proud of that. And uh, I've won some, some uh, league tournaments and things, and, and that to me is such a great feeling, that feeling of winning. Um, so I want to keep focused on my journey. And as you're, as you're going forward and making progress, take every three or four months, just take time to reflect on how far you've come because you'll probably realize a lot about yourself that you kind of got lost in the weeds because you got so distracted with trying to stay focused on this one goal. So that's all I got for this one. Catch you in the next one.